One of the big changes that may come from these amendments is an update to the current zoning plan that would allow for an expanse of heavy industrial use in certain areas surrounding Laurel. Now, these proposed changes would heavily impact a methane power plant that has been in the works for over a year, otherwise known as Northwestern Energy's Yellowstone Generating Station. It was proposed by Northwestern Energy in December of 2022, and they began building it a few months later. It's faced several legal challenges over the course of the last year, and some residents in the area surrounding the power plant have been vocal against the plant's construction. Uh, but with the potential amendments to Laurel's 2020 growth policy, that area would instead be zoned for industrial use. North, Northern Plains and Environmental Conservation Organization said in a press release that while they are worried about the zoning changes allow, allowing for the development of the plant, they are more worried about how these changes will change the character of their community overall and impact Yellowstone County in the future. I also reached out to Northwestern Energy, who sent me a statement saying, in part, the 175 megawatt Yellowstone County generating station is a cost effective resource for generation for Northwestern Energy to serve our Montana customers reliably when they need energy the most, such as the coldest winter nights. The Yellowstone County generating stations on demand generation is needed to bring more variable wind and solar, solar generation onto the grid and those public com that public hearing rather is set to kick off in just under an hour here at Laurel City Hall and residents are encouraged to come down and offer their contributions to the discussion. Reporting live, I'm Ren Wadsworth. Back to you, John.